Black holes were not discovered by Einstein, but their genesis is predicted by his general theory of relativity. Instead, Carl Schwarzschild was the first to demonstrate that black holes might really develop, using Einstein's groundbreaking calculations. Schwarzschild's findings gave rise to the phrase, Schwarzschild radius, which describes how much an object would need to be compressed. Black holes didn't have their official name until 1967, but British polymath John Michel predicted the existence of dark stars that may be so enormous or squeezed that light couldn't escape from their gravitational pull.